Hello there, everyone. Hello, everyone. My name is Ghost Wolf Alpha, back again with another stream tonight. Today is Monday, May 20th, 2024, and you know what that is means? That means it's Battletech Vance 362. Where we left off is we did a bunch of mission, but bunch of we did a bit of the heavy heavy metal bat um, battles, and then there's a um the um, uh, campaign. That's it. Brain fart. Not fun. Anyway. And we also took out a dropship, and we failed because we, because I did not realize that the if you destroy all the turrets, it will take off within a certain amount of time. So we're gonna possibly take out a dropship again. This time, focus fire on the dropship more than than mopping up with the rest of the units. At least. That's the that's the theory anyway. Now the game is right now still loading up, so it's going to be a tiny bit. So how are you all doing, chat? I hope you're all doing well. Anyway, I was a little bit off. Tomorrow is the end of the b end of the Battle of Tukian. But still, still, I'm, I may be one day off. Whatever. Okay, is the game? Yep, game's all ready. Anyway, let's get started, shall we? Okay, come on, game. Pop up. Thank you. Okay, where were we? Check out navigation real quick. The thing hasn't popped off yet, so we've got a little bit of time. And I'm thinking heading towards... Head towards Gouch... Not head towards that way. Head towards the... Towards Merchant Rest. By your command. See if there's anything interesting there to buy before we continue on our way. While that while we're doing that, we're gonna I'm gonna get some music going. I wrapped up that job you asked for, Commander. Okay, let's go with hair metal for tonight. Oh, hello. Why aren't you? Playing on my computer here. <laughs> oh, I see what happened. It just. Thank you, Spotify, from disconnecting to my main compute from my main computer. What the? There we go. Anyone here? Oh, I should have done that before we got out. Head to merchant's rest. Merchant's rest. Oh well. You know, I'm not really prepared for streaming tonight. Not because of because of that, it because of usually because of the little hiccups here and there. But I have no drink. <laughs> okay, let's visit the store. And then I'm going to go quickly grab myself a glass of water. So I'll be right back.
And I'm back! Sorry about that, everyone. Because I could tell I was gonna get thirsty, and by the- And because I can't have my fan running in the wind- in my window. Because you'll hear the fan running. And that's not a good thing. Especially when I'm trying to speak. Okay, let's sell some mechs here. Let's sell that archer. Keep it the atlas. Keep you. Keep. I'm trying to think of what I can get rid of. Seriously, get rid of. I'm not getting rid of the imp, nor the ironclad. No. I'm getting rid of the osprey. Get rid of that salamander also, I really don't have a use for it, honestly. Okay, let's... I almost forgot <laughs> the thunder that I just barely saw. Sorry about that, chat. The yawn, that is. Here's the thunder, thunder, thunder. Where are you? There we go. Got rid of the thunder. Any. Again, any mechs that would be interesting to get. Well, that would. No. No, that's not gonna work for us. That won't work for us either. I only buy ones for the for the UAC twenties, but no. Uh, the Medusa. Uh, no. There's really nothing here. I thought there was going to be more. I will take the web targeting computer. We'll just let time pass. So we can get the flashpoint. Yeah, membership fee. Do 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 do. I've got the financial report. Right now, just waiting on. Oh, here's something interesting. Oh, it's that it's this guy. <laughs> And welcome him and his mysteries aboard. <laughs> that mech you wanted is back online. <laughs> God dang, author. Is it? Oh, there it is. Get 
case you're wondering what this hat, which is why we're doing a little bit of waiting. Get rid of the medium lasers. Put in some clan tech ones. Well, it has a case too, I'd rather put the ammo in the feetsies. Not the thunderbolt itself! <laughs> And I maybe I believe I got ammo for it. Yes, I do. There. Logged and noted. Shouldn't be too hard. Anyone interesting? Commander. Ah, uh, really? Job's done, Commander. Okay, let's just move up. Let's just move to Cormadier for now. Roger that, Commander. Course plotted. Says we just have to wait for them. Got a new financial report for you, Commander. Yeah, yeah, I know. Okay, just realized something. I got a whole bunch of stuff in the in the vehicle bay that I'm not really using. Holy sh! I... <laughs> I didn't realize I had this much! There, that should reduce the costs from the mech from the vehicle base. And let's just store the battle armor. We haven't been really using that that much. Actually, that one I'm gonna keep out. Hey, do you realize how much how much stuff I didn't ha have? Settling the training training simulators. Come on. I'll tap just to ch check something, and what do I get? Okay, what are you uh, doing? Please don't do this to me. Okay, we're having some issues with the encoder now. Great. 
Are you gonna behave, game? Where's the computer? And just as we got to Cormadier, it popped up. Let's prioritize Sumeri's, Sumeri's lead. Appian, of course. I wonder. Just doing something, just a little bit of checking here. Oh, I just remembered. I didn't say that I'm playing on Twitter. Give me one second, chat. There we go. And we're going to go back to... We're going to go to Appian after, after I get out of this. There. Calculating course now, Commander. And I'll get there before the financial report. <laughs> sequence, okay. Okay. There we go. Do 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 do. Come on, game. Thank you. I hope we're all doing good tonight, chat. At least tonight in my in my where I am. Could be morning for where you are for all I know. But I hope what however your day is going, I hope it's going going pretty good. Okay, let's begin. Okay, Commander, I performed a sensor sweep of the planet's surface to confirm what we talked about earlier and everything checks out. The Dobrev is moored at the spaceport about 200 clicks beneath our feet. Nice, we're about to send that pal of yours a case of Tembiki Dark. <laughs> Wouldn't we'll know where, where to find him, Yang. Guy's on the run. <laughs> Turns out he's been running his mouth to lots of people, and the Frontier's Colonel Underground really, really hates a snitch. Ooh, too bad for him, but we got the intel we need. I'm counting this as a win for us. <laughs> Don't start celebrating just yet, Commander. There's a snag. We can't move on the spaceport, at least not directly. The whole com complex is surrounded by turrets, but besides, the moment the Dobrev's replacement crew catches wind of us, they're going to try to run. And injure themselves terribly when their their attempt, uh, uh, attempt to KF jump, maybe even destroy the ship. Yeah, I don't get the feeling that Nocter Bauman gives two shits about his hired help. The Bowman group has jumped the Dobrev before, and if we back these people into a corner, they'll absolutely do it again. 
That is almost certainly true. We've all dealt with Dr. Barman. We know what the man is like. He wouldn't hesitate to maim his own employees if he felt he could profit from it. Thankfully, I believe that the Mueller, Mulderborn and I have found a solution. Just a moment, I'll put on... Oh, one second. I'll put on the view screen. Okay, just some hiccup on my other computer that keeps track of things here. Your view screen fills the fills with the grainy silhouette of a squat boxy building complex. What you're seeing is a security post about 20 clicks no north of the spaceport. If we capture this site, we can bring down the turrets and remotely engage the spaceport stocking clamps. Two birds with one stone. With the clamps engaged, the Dobrev won't be going anywhere. Even the Bauman group wouldn't try jumping a ship that's locked down to the tarmac. That's the play, then. We hit the complex, transfer control of its computers to Motorburn, and then move on to the spaceport. We know what we're doing, people. Let's get it done. Come on, let's start. Well, I'm not going to take the thunder ham the one of the thunder hammer LAMs. Just have have Harmony Park at the back. Right now, we just have to wait for it to load. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Hi, Yoza, how you doing? We're right now waiting for the game to load up. The mission, that is. Okay, Yoza. Oh. Yeah. 
By the way, I'm running. You, I have no fans running, and my door is. The my basically, I closed off my room because don't want, be, don't want extraneous noises coming in, or basically become too loud. Uh oh. There we go. I swear, it's frickin' unity. As I was saying, I'm, I don't have my fan running, which is supposed to help keep me cool, but... Command interface initiated. Okay, okay, Commander, I've set our lance out just outside the bombing troop visual range. Defenses will be probably out running on the heavy side, so I recommend approaching with caution. Yes, but not too much caution. We need to take the facility stats so the, so the Mjolder Baron can lock, da lock down the Dobro's docky docking clasps. This mission won't count for much if the ship runs off again. Don't worry, Doc, we won't leave Mama Bear hanging. And we won't let the Dobrev escape. We can't... We can't. The rest of our mystery mechs hidden away on that ship. That's the theory. And we're going to investigate it. But first, we engage the clamps. You know what to do, Commander. I'll leave you to it. I should have brought the oh, LAM man. then. This place is hotter than my mixtape. Heading that way. On the way, nice and slow. Commander? I'll race ya. Okay, if I remember, that's supposed to be that sway back. Got a lock. No, that's an enforcer. I was wrong. That should be the sway back. Oh well. I was wrong. Duncan Fisher here. Please don't do this to me, game. Oh, come on. Thank you. Heading that way! What do you need, Commander? SRMs. That guy is taking a real beating this first, technically second round. Okay, I'm gonna. I need to do a little experimenting with the uh, airflow in here because everything has just gotten stuffy. Hopefully, if I position this correctly, I could at least remain somewhat cool and have some airflow. And it just doesn't, sh the sound doesn't show up on the, on the thing here. Come on, OBS, I want to see you. Okay, it's not being picked up. That's good. Damage 
Minimal. If you're hearing my fan, just tell me in chat because don't want it to be too bad. Acknowledge. Well, you can't hear a thing, that is. And... Two will do, and turn off those small lasers. Hey, can I do three with that, then? Eh. Uh, yeah. Locking on. <laughs> the Cobra strikes. Generating a lot of heat, Commander. How bad is the internals? Wow. And there's the Hunchback 4P. Damage is minor, Commander. Duncan Fisher here. Heading that way. And if I remember correctly, yes, the ammo's over there. Turn off those. Uh, might as well take the risk. Something just went boom. What's that smell? Looks like bourbon and steak. What do you need, Commander? Taking the shot, Commander. Well, at least that's a good thing. Yeah, it's a case of... case of, I don't want to... I... In case of it's gonna it's right now seventy nine outside. It was eighty one this morning. There's a um today. I don't want to be be broiling myself in my room. Just have to wait for them to think about what they're doing. I'm at I'm at 71 Fahrenheit. There's a 79 Fahrenheit I meant, which I don't know how how to convert it to Celsius. There we go. 25 degrees out. Yeah, there it's goes Celsius, the paint job. that is. Oh, this is not good. Hey, don't you know who I am? Powering up. I await your command. Roger that. Drop it down to two. Okay, drop it down to one. Engaging target. I got the heat spiking here. Oops. 
sorry about that. Scratch my cheek and really hit the mic. Hey, Tex, Tex Willer, how you doing? I'm doing good. You need to move over here. Okay, I got eyes as a security co complex commander. Take it, and we'll get the show on the road. The area isn't clear. Eliminate hostiles and secure it before proceeding to your next objective. I know that. Oh, good, the pilot's bleeding out. got one fundamental thing about this fan of mine. It walks. Hey, don't you know who I am? As in the vibrations of it, it just jostles it and makes it move on its own. Uh-oh. Player's loading on my end for the stream preview. Hell walking fan, the wonders of technology. Yep. Congratulations, you just Congratulations, you ejected. How do you feel? Uh what's that? Okay, which one? Okay, that's uh that's the enforcer I was dealing with. Heading that way. Let's turn on the media pulses. Get the meat grinders to the max. And just go to town on the rear arc. Flying them all up! That's the way the mech warrior crumbled. Warning. Armor low. Armor low where? Waiting for orders. Oh, I should not have done that. Oh, well. Uh, too much. Stick with that. Locking target. Ooh, I must have hit the ammo. Hope we can salvage that. Ah, uh, it's... Ever been kind of stuck in any contract? Not really. What do you need, Commander? So far, I've been doing f fine with them. Though there used to be one, um, which was the Bang of the Hounds, I believe it was. Before I, before the whole, you can now control the the escort vehicles. Taking the shot, Commander. I'm just having my... Full throttle. My Kodiak sprint there. Now, what are you gonna do? You got two tempting targets, and you go for the Warhammer. Don't you know who I am? 
Uh, huh? Headshot. That's a kill. And salvageable. What do you need, Commander? Because I can't. Time to pour on I the speed. I moved the longbow up, even though. Uh, even though I'm confident with the long range, I don't want it to be too out of range. Okay, game's thinking. Heads up, Commander. You've got hostile contacts inbound. Yeah, and they're somewhere over here. Oh. And what do we have here? I live to serve. If I remember correctly, there's an Orion, a Battlemaster, and I can't remember what that is. Uh, huh? Heading that way! I'm gonna have to reserve down one more... Damage minimal. And it's a spider. Sensor lock on target. Hopefully that won't move, but I highly doubt it will... That I won't... We'll have that... Not move, anyway. Come on. Oh! Thank you! What do you need, Commander? Yeah, I definitely need to move up. On the way, nice and slow. Because I got a feeling that's going to be a pain in my butt. Taking the shot, Commander. That's one oh, more bad dark guy off splitter. the board. Um, coming in with a raid of, coming in with that raid. Thank you all for coming, all for dropping by. My name's Ghost Wolf Alpha. I'm I'm a, I'm usually a sci-fi variety streamer. Um, as of but I usually have my stables of Mech Ground Line and Baltic Advanced 362. So if it that sounds in, if any of that sounds interesting to you, please hit that heart icon down below to follow me. <laughs> So how are you all doing tonight? Did you have a good stream?
Oh, you were playing Battletech, I see. Um, any, any mods? And thank you, Striker Music, for following. <laughs> oh, <laughs> playing Battletech Advanced 362, Rogue Tech, Vanilla. Just curious on that. Yep, Commander. On the move, full speed. Ah! <laughs> Yeah, I'm. Yeah, this playthrough I'm trying to finish up before I take myself a two week break on this, and then I'm going to be starting a new save. Because right now, this is more or less complete. I got the Arano campaign done, I'm right now taking care of the Heavy Metal campaign, and once we're done with that, it's basically a two week hiatus I'm about to advance, and then doing it all over again. <laughs> Oh, word word of Blake rep run. Nice. Uh, huh? I've done that before. Heading that way. Um, not on stream, mind you. Something to keep in mind for next for when I do my next playthrough. Ooh, this is going to be real fun. Well, might as well take the risk. Oh, of course, hot in shut here. down. What's that smell? Like bourbon and steak. That's you, you keep drinking too much. And having too much steak. And there's the rest of them. What do you need, Commander? Move up. And fire on that Phoenix Hawk. Taking the shot, Commander. Oh, good, the center torso's open. That's nice. When it comes to my turn over here. I'll focus fire on the Kodiak. Not the Kodiak. The Kodiak will focus fire on the Shadow Hawk. Phoenix Hawk. Damage minimal. Oh, please don't do this to me. You... Ah, uh, it's my... It's the player. Or it's my encoding. I have to double check settings real quick. No, just simply the stream preview on my end. That case, I'm refreshing everything chat on the second computer of mine. Well, I'm in the capture zone. That's good. Even better news. Yeah, this Kodiak of mine, I personally made made for made for my game here. Because okay, incoming transmission. Okay, from Dr. Bauman. You're quite persistent, Commander Wheeler. You're like a bad rash. I just can't seem to get rid of you. I could crack that obvious joke about th the obvious joke about that, but it'd just be too easy. What's coming to you is no laughing matter. I hired a new kill team commander. They'll keep you company while my ground crew prepares the Dobra for departure. We've got new heat signatures, commander. Incoming Max assault class. Um, we're already fighting them. <laughs> Get on it, commander, and take him out quick. We need to seize that security complex before the Dobra is clear to launch. But yeah, I'm. I'd like to try to make my own. My own custom mechs for BTA. I haven't really released them yet. And the Kodiak Omni mech here is one of them. I based it off of the whole the whole thing in MechWarrior 
two mercenaries. You know how every single mech, even though you know it's a, no, it's a actual mech mech like fixed hard points. They treat it all like Omni mechs, like say the Atlas as an Omni mech. Uh, what's that? So hence the Kodiak Omni mech here. Stop that, that's expensive. I'm your spaniel. On my way. Double time. Okay, go we'll go get a sensor lock on. Let's focus on on the battle master. That has a little bit more priority. What do you need, Commander? Uh, that's a better angle. On the way, nice and slow. It was just off, just a... Eh. Let's see if we can try to go for a headshot here. Taking the shot, Commander. Well, at least the side torso's open. That target's having a real bad day. Okay, just to warn you all, incoming ad break, as the as it says in chat. I I like ads as much as the next person, which is not at all. But when you when you have affiliate, when it, because you get all the benefits of affiliate, and then you have ads as the downside, which honestly don't like the ads. But what can you do? Oh, it's a SRM explosion. Dang, one salvageable part. And it's the Orions that's left. I'm receiving you. Onward. Now, let's see, is the ammo still intact? Yes, it is. Let's fight the Stormbreakers. Engaging. And... I destroyed the ammo! <laughs> I was taking a risk there. <laughs> okay, Leopard inbound, Commander. I'll be touching down directly. At stun it, Commander. I've gained access to the complex's computers and transferred the control to Mjolder Bjorn. Thank you, Doctor. I've deactivated the spaceport search and engaged the spaceport's docking clamps. The Dobrev won't be going anywhere without my permission. <laughs> Hang on a second, we're getting a comm message over an unknown channel. Follow me again? I'm sure, but wait. Motherfu- This can't be happening, it just can't! What is it, Meyer? Who do you have on the line? The goddamned Black Widow, that's who! Did I miss something, Commander? When did our search for the Dobrev be turn into a meet and greet with Natasha F. and Kerensky? You better put her through, Meyer. There's one mech warrior we don't want to leave hanging is the Black Widow. The Black Widow is it. That goes for you too, boss. Better get out of the view screen, and you better do it now. Mission successful. Okay, I'm... Okay, I'm just checking if the fan was... was being picked up by microphone. I'm just worried about the fan t tonight, that's all. Also, while I'm at it, better check how... how we're doing on memory usage. Okay.
Okay, we're doing fine on memory usage. Thank you, Dark Splinter, for following. And, of course, we're all fine. Just simply a bit of armor damage. Nothing that can't be hammered out or buffed out. I'm taking that hunchback. And I might as well take that spider part. Battle master part. And the enforcer. And I got all the stuff. And ads are incoming in one minute. Or at least 40 seconds from my thing here. <laughs> Even a mech work could repair this damage. <laughs> Yeah, that's what happens when you. That's what. Ha but what will happen is, what uh, is the Mech Warriors will break out the Bondo and just simply, just spackle in the holes. <laughs> I bet it's Lost Tech Bondo. Okay, Hourglass Two. Black Widow, I'm Darius Olivia, EXO of Ghost Wolves Pack. Tell us what you need, I'll do my best to make it happen. I ca called to talk to the commander of Ghost Wolves Pack, not, the, not a switchboard operator. Put Wheeler on the screen. He's down, Black Widow, I'm right here. Good, I don't want this to take any longer than it has to. You've been shattering the Doe Breath, trailing it to every port of call, having friendly chats with a bounty, bounty hunter, a man who I have publicly marked for death. He isn't our friend, he's, gr he's a grandstanding asshole who gave us a crate. But you received that crate. T took it into your ship. You still have what you found inside. How would you know where we have and haven't been up to? Or say, what we have been up to. I had caught a few of Bauman's pirates, one of the bounty hunter's associates, too. I encountered no difficulty get get getting them to talk. The Dobrev has a history that you can't know, Wheeler. It shouldn't exist and neither should its payload. It's a problem and I intend to solve it. Why are you telling us this? Because words are cheaper than bullets. But don't make, don't mis mistake my willingness to talk for weakness, Wheeler. Every word from my mouth carries an ultimatum. You follow my instructions, if you don't, your company will die. Tell us what you want, then. I'm listening. Give me one second, I need to have a sip of drink. <clears throat> I want the bounties hunters create along with anything else that that came from the derelict. The machine intelligence you're babysitting too. Dump everything at the Bowman's group spaceport. I want to pile near the Dobriff when I arrive. So why? So you can slag it all in one go? That's right, I value efficiency. You've heard my demands, Wheeler. Meet them and you'll escape with your life. Do anything else and you won't. And you won't. The choice is yours. And it winks out. The image winks out and leaving the view screen blank. What the shit? Anyone know what any of that was about? Not a clue, but her name Natasha Kerensky is Natasha Kerensky and we're chasing uh, uh, General, Alex and, ah, General Alexander Kerensky's exodus. That can't be a coincidence, can it? Could she be a descendant of his, perhaps? Yeah, sure, in the same way that everyone na named Patel, Patel is related to all other Patels, and all the people named Smith live together in communal form on Arturus. Point take is still the Dobra has been floating out in the deep periphery for the past 50 years, and who knows where before that. The Black Widow shouldn't know anything about that ship. Nobody should. None of that matters right now, Doctor. We have a serious problem. If the Black Widow Company reaches the spaceport, and there's nothing we could do to keep the Dober safe, and there's nothing we could do to keep the Dober safe, it's too large a target. And with a docking collapse in place, our derelict will be a sitting duck. Yeah, then we'll have, then we'll go. To, you know what? We'll have to disengage the docking collapse. Give me Doctor Bauman. 
Okay. Calling to Gloat Wheeler? Or do you intend to demand a ransom for my ship? You won't get it. I already have reinforcements out of the way. No, we're releasing the docking claps. Run! I still have material on the spaceport. You will, you will allow my crew to take it aboard the Dobra before it departs. Anything that isn't on that ship belongs to us now, Bauman. Don't try our patience. Take your goddamn ship and run. Uh, two steps forward, two steps back. But at least we got a shot at scooping up whatever's left at the spaceport. I'll have to beat the Black Widow there to do it. She'll be as eager to destroy whatever contraband Bowman left behind as we are to acquire it. God help our mechwares if they have to face off against the Black Widow. Sounds like to me we need a distraction. Something to peel the angry lady away from her lands. You think your drones will be up to it, Mama Bear? Should sound like with the Widow um, had you on her hit list. She calls you out specifically. If you took a swing at her, she'd probably sit up and take notice. Agree, Chief Fertran. I will do what what I can to lure her away from the rest of her company. That's what I like to hear, Mama Bear. Come on, Doc, you're with me. Let's let's get our salvage team ready for the drop. And Exo, you'd better give our mech warriors the mother of all pep talks. They're gonna need it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Training required. I don't care. And let's start this up. Long, the longbow will not be of too much use. And I need some actual firepower. And the... And that... And that mech... And that um, Royal, Royal Warhammer is a little bit too spicy for me to use. But I do have Tex back on. Tex, where are you? There you are. Okay, put you in your awesome. Sorry, it's not as not up to your standards again. But it, it's what happens when Sumeri pancakes it. Let's go with Let's go with the Matar for you. And what do I want to have break out? You know what? You take the dire wolf. Let's do this. I'm thinking after this mission, we're gonna go take we're gonna go take out a dropship again. Hopefully we'll do better this time. I'm still gonna do the do the usual nuke everything, and then and then char and then basically. Ha but instead of fishing off the other mechs outside, leave two dedicated for that, and then have the rest focus fire on the dropship. And if it takes off again, well, we'll have to come up with a new strategy. Do 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 do. Let's 
simply have to wait for it to load. An undefined amount of valuable contraband, yep. Oh, I'm excited for tomorrow's patch in MechWare Online. Excuse me, ah, bit of a hiccup there. Because, whew, oh, what the? First a hiccup, then a yawn, great. As I was trying, to, as I keep trying to say, I'm glad that the the patch for tomorrow is coming up for MechWare Online, because the bull shark's going to be added from added to it, and I can't wait to get my I can't wait to for it to be to see the builds that people come up for it. I actually have myself a plan for when I whenever that gets to the store with using. MC. I'm I'm buying the um, buying the hero mech up when it comes out for MC because I don't care if there's a sale going on for it or not, I'm getting it. Command I just like the bull shark. It looks nice. Alright, Commander, I've just set you down in front of the bombman's abandoned spaceport. Farah, Yang, and their team should already be inside. Can you confirm that, Yang? Yeah, Meyer, we're here, but I'm calling this whatever it is a spaceport. It's awfully charitable of you. We're standing in it, it, what we're standing in is a chop shop, chop shop, and a poorly organized one at that. Then you better get your team to work. If the rest of our mystery mech is boxed up somewhere in that complex, they'll have a limited time to f have to find it. Understood, Exo. For my part, I'm working to crack the encryption on the facility computers. If they contain information on where the Dobro is going next, I promise you I will find it. Hate to interrupt, but the party's about to get started down there. I got a lance of hostile mechs converging on the spaceport. The Black Widow herself is nowhere to be seen, so I guess Yang's let's throw the Mo Motor Bjorn's drones at her plan is working out. For the time being, it appears to be true. That said, I suggest you engage and destroy the, her land space as quickly as possible. The Black Widow is already inflicting ruinous damage on my, on my combat drones, and I won't be able to keep her occupied forever. Okay, Commander, we need to buy Fair and Yang as much time as possible. Keep the, keep the Black Widow company away from that complex, and I'll call it any complications as they arise. Duncan Fisher here. Heading that way. Okay, an ice ferret. What's this mech? Wolverine? Don't do that, that's expensive! On the clock, what do you want? Okay, come on. Let's make some bad decisions at high speed. Well, at least one of them hit. It's pretty fucking warm in here. Thunderbolts. Okay. They're part of Wolf Dragoons, specifically hey, under guy. the command of Natasha Kerensky, and you know who, who she is. Move. Friendly. 
primitive. There we go. Took down the. Took down that side torso. Hey, I think that's the mech I have in MechWare Online. Or is that the P2? I can't remember. Duncan Fisher here. Heading that way. You know what? Just, oh yeah, I did customize it, duh. Lighting them up. Oh well, that's the way the Mech Warrior crumbled. Okay, that's a better angle for it. Let's see if I'm sober enough to line this up. Sometimes failing is important. Technically the mostly be painful. Technically the whole both the Arano campaign and the heavy metal campaign are pre-clan base. Set around 3025. But because of Baltic Advance 362, we've been there moved forward in time, of course. Don't ask me how that works <laughs> for for in-game lore. <laughs> in, there's a in this game in particular with the with the mod. For all we know, this this version of of Natasha Kerensky is a clone. Commander, I'll race ya. Acknowledge. Okay, what is that? Hoplite? Yeah, that's a hoplite. It's a frisbee with legs! <laughs> Duncan Fisher here. Okay, that would just be a bad target right this second. Take out that Wolverine. One second. Oh well, that's the way the Mech Warrior crumble. Oh, getting hot in here. Oh, what the heck just happened? <laughs> oh, I must have overheated. Yeah, that just... Yeah, that's not good. Okay, come on, don't please, don't freeze on me. Okay, sorry about that, everyone. <laughs> Encoder overload again. Oh, 
Well, this was a more advanced top light, as you can see here. It has a Clan UAC-10 and a multi-missile launch, multi launcher 7. And you know what I have to say to that? Oh. Wait, first off... Is... You need to go back to Frisbee Golf! I <laughs> thought they used good mechs. Mind you, this is just cannon fodder right here. For us, that is. I might have to eject. Hey, yep. Understandable. Clock, what do you want? What type of engine? XL. Inner Sphere XL. Let's see if I'm sober enough to line this up. Of course, I all tabbed and it fixes itself. Now are you going to behave? Thank you. Ready for orders. Need to have these guys move. Oh, come on! Primitive. You know what? I'm gonna do something real quick. I'm turning down the settings. Yeah, quality custom. Advanced. Tree quality low, lighting quality medium, texture stays the same, terrain. Thought I said, got that off, oh well. Good. Shouldn't sync Okay. That should help. I could be wrong, though. Cry havoc. There goes those. Mech destroyed. Good, there goes that lance. All right, everything seems a little bit better, somewhat. I could be full. Of, I could be full of it. Heads up, Commander. You've got hostile contacts inbound. And they should be over. Yeah, over here, I believe. It's a viper.
Centurion D. Very there's a yeah the D the D version of it. Oh please don't do this to me, computer. Might as well throw the. Might as well get their attention. Oh, uh, what's that? Alright, up we go. Half the mech. Okay, I blew up the entire mech. <laughs> uh, huh? Heading that way. Key. Hopefully we get ourselves a good sh good hit on it. Eh, not really. Oh, it's a yeoman. Oh, please, no, 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 no! I want one of our structures has been eliminated. I wanted the bonus. Senator Torso shot at that. Ooh. Watch my heat. One more Take good hit on that, and that'll be down. It doesn't have that LBX. Uh, huh? Heading that way. And destroyed. the Centurion left. Enemy mech. Critical damage detected. 
Okay, good. Now it's Texas turn. Clock. What do you want? Let's make some bad decisions at high speed. And let's go for center mass. That'll be perfect. One attitude adjustment coming right up. And there goes the, the centurion. I'm obligated to inform you on paper kill. It's getting pretty fucking warm in here. Can't really help you out there. Because of our duff. Can't really take out that yeoman because if I did, I'd shoot the shoot myself on that. Now what is that yeoman gonna do? I can't really melee. There we go, all taken care of. That's for that's what you get for taking out my bonus. Well done, you managed to wipe out the op wipe the op four out. I could do an ex do an extract right now, no need to Get to our planned LZ. Hostiles down for the moment, and the AO is cleared. Can't imagine it'll stay that way for long, though. Motorbjorn, do you still have eyes on the Black Widow? Negative, negative, Miss Olivia. She is almost certainly on her way to obliterate the spaceport. And that's our cue to leave. Then we'll see you in orbit, Commander. We've got a lot to talk about. Mission successful. Okay, after this mission, I think we're going to restart BTA here. Because we're starting to get high amounts of memory issue here. Uh, for me, that is. Okay, take the Bushwhacker, the Yeoman. There we go. I can't believe it. We went up against the Black Widow Company, Natasha Kurinsky's hand-picked killers, and survived. 
Right a feather in our cap, Exo. This one will give us bragging rights throughout the frontier. Yeah, sure, it was a good win, but we wouldn't have anything to brag about if the Motor Bureau's distraction hadn't worked. The Black Widow is the most dangerous mech warrior alive, full stop. If she made it to that, to that fight, every one of us would have been dead. I still don't get why she wants to wreck the Dobrev. It doesn't make any sense. We'll probably never know, but there's one thing we can say for certain. If the Black Widow reaches the derelict before we do, this whole enterprise will come crashing down around us. All this will have been for nothing. I don't know if I'd go that far, Exo. Me and the dock, in the dock, we hit the mother load in that shipyard. With Motor Bjorn's help, I think we might be able to make some of those of those parts the bounty hunter sent us, and by something I mean an absolute beast of a battle mech. Well, you got my attention, Yang. What kind of mech are we talking about? I could tell you, but I think we should let Motor Bjorn do the honors. Without its help, we'll ne we would never have recovered what we would have found what we were looking for. You still online, Mama Bear? Yes, Chief Bert Bertrand. When, when completed, the rebuilt Battlemech will be an assault class brawler in the 95 ton range with an integrated ar conventional artillery piece. That is a hell of a thing. What's it called? The Bull Shark. Interesting, the insignia on the, chassis on the chassis pieces we found depicts a predatory Terran mammal, a wolverine if I'm not mistaken. A curious choice of heraldry to adorn a Battlemech for, for, named for a shark. Doesn't matter, we'll repaint it to, into our company's colors before it hits the field. And I'm looking forward to seeing this mech in action. Yeah, me too. Yeah, boss, me too. Speaking of which, I'm going to check it out on our new baby. You know, get her ready to show off. And I'll return to standby status, Commander. Please have Dr. Maraud bring me back online when you've picked up the Dobra's trail. Mr. Olivia, I suggest that you focus your search on... Mantharka, judging by the files I was able to recover. I think it's likely that the derelict was taken there. I could, though I could not find the exact coordinates. Even if it's on Mantharka, it's a, a star system is a big place. We're going to need to narrow down our options and find ourselves some coordinates. I'll put some feelers out the feelers again. Grease the palms of a few jump ship crews. Maybe somebody's heard something. In the meantime, we should scrounge up more independent work. It'll be a good excuse to feed, field test our new bull shark. Yeah, 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 training, blah, blah, blah. Want to see the mech. That mech you wanted is back online. And. Sorry to say this, but the trebuchet goes into storage. We'll do a little bit of modification, and then we're going to take attempt to take out the dropship. Behave. Okay, I'm going to save and restart this after. Oh, please don't do don't do this to me. Behave. I will hit you, computer. I don't know if you heard that thump, but that was me hitting my computer. <laughs> Ow! Should have brought a hammer instead. We're doing. We're going to be reloading the game, just so you know. Uh, that while it's doing that, I'll tell you a little story. Because hitting that computer decide to make me remember this story. My dad had this computer. This is the 90s, mind you. Computers were a little bit more robust, in my opinion. CRT monitors and all that jazz. Now, my dad, my dad had this computer, computer that 
you had to literally disassemble the whole thing in order to fix this it one issue which you just simply had to touch the IDE ribbon cable literally touch touch and then it would be fine well my dad didn't want to do that so one so we hit the computer it w was fine for a month well one day he got a little bit too how too angry with the computer so he took a hammer and hit it on top of the case and it left a dent computer never gave him a problem again he even sold that computer with the dent in it yeah I must say I do miss the day, miss the old days with with the with computer with with uh basically my old days with my computer. I used to like when I when I got my first computer, I was five years old. Oh, I, it was a compact. I can't remember what model it was. Oh, I had fun with it. I got into and then I got into the BIOS and I bricked it. My dad was impressed. A little upset, but impressed. <laughs> and so, that also got me interested in computers. And so when I was about six, dad taught me a, taught me a bit. And basically proceeded to let me t get a, have a screwdriver, literally a screwdriver and a flashlight, and go to town disassembling a computer. And then after the words, he said, "All right, time time to assemble it." And I did. Mind you, the, mind you, we didn't have like thermal paste back then. It was a case of let's bolt down the CPU sink, to, the the heat sink to the CPU as best as possible. And then once. Once we got all that taken care of, I, um, he decided to reinstall Windows on his computer. I re I installed Windows on mine. Mind you, this was Windows 98, second edition. And so after we got the got got it all start started up, we used we basically went out to get ourselves some drinks. We went out to the local quick quick stop. He got coffee, I got myself a Gatorade, soda, whatever. At that time, come back, it's halfway done. Yeah, nowadays though, it's quick with, with like say Windows 10, Windows 11, it's quick to install. Although I do miss those days. Okay, come on, load up faster, game. Want to get to the fight with a dropship. Actually, no, we're not going to do a fight with a dropship. We got a little bit too much. We got too little time, in my opinion. We're going to do some random missions, get some cash flow in. And then we'll hopefully get another... We'll get the... Get the heavy metal mission going. Usually the last, last contract. You know, I just realized something. I usually have my chatbot timer going, and I forgot to enable it.
There we go. All taken care of. And of course, I have to wait till wait till I get a, able to get back in. Oh, when I was, I think, about 10-ish, I was old enough to go on the internet, and ba it was eight, around 8, 8, 10, I was old enough to go on the internet. My dad said, you go to any, any inappropriate sites, he's just going to rip the computer out of the thing. Well, one day I got a virus, and what happened next? Basically, I go to this website, I did this, this, and this, and boom, inappropriate website. Oh, I got so panicky. <laughs> yeah. Then my dad came home and I explained everything to it to him. Basically did this, this, and this, and boom. And so he explained it's not my fault, he has to fix the computer up. <laughs> because at that time I didn't know anything about viruses that Okay, let's go to navigation here. Nah, we're not going to Detroit. Wait, do we have any contracts here for cash flow before we go? That, that sounded interesting. No, I am not going for the Capella Confederation. Okay. Local government. Local government. Yep. Compelling Confederation, um, what is the word I'm looking for? Dang it, I can't remember. But anyway, it goes down. I want to make it go down. Oh, that reminds me. First, before we do that, I want to see what we have in the mech, have on that bull shark here. Thumper cannon, okay. And LBX 10s. I'm taking out the thumper cannon for now. No. Come on. I'm going to keep the keep the inner sphere heat sinks in there. Upgrade the case to shields. I like those better than the standard case. LBX 10 clan versions. Actually, no, not the, not those. The ultras. <laughs> Makes better sense in my opinion. Clan mediums. Actually, no, we're going to swap out the heat sinks in a tiny bit. First, put the lasers in. Next. Yeah, we're gonna put the thumper in.
Now for the ammo. Do I have enough? That's my question. Oh, I got plenty. Okay, put the clusters in. Now let's adjust and let's pivot the pivot to a clan heat dual heat sink setup. Where's the heat sink get? There we go. Yeah, I'm running low on those. There we go. And I think we're good. Right. I'll get it in the schedule. Yeah, that'll take 13 days. I'm okay with waiting. Until then. It's time to make the Capellans angry. <laughs> Capellan's Angie fix. <laughs> Hang on. Let's get the Annihil- Nah, not the Annihilator 2 out. Let's go with- Not the Royal Thug. Let's- Okay, let's go with the Atlas here. You'll go back into your more hammer. Harmony the longbow. Seventy five. Seventy. Seventy. Fifty five. And Perfect. I only want 10 mechs total. Okay, card Shadoon. No. Let's put you in the Timberwolf. Obo, Thunderhammer, Shade, Thunderhammer, the Coital, actually move you, the Scorpion, you back into your Timberwolf, there we go. Anyway, I want to check up on. Anyway, I want to check up on you, Chad. How are you all doing? Need anything adjusted, music-wise? Louder, quieter? Hear the fan at all? Just tell me. But I hope you're all doing pretty good, and you're being entertained.
warning because it just popped up. The ads are incoming in five minutes. As you all know, I don't like the ads, but it's the way Twitch is. I tried to delay it as tried to delay it as long as an hour. There we go. Command interface initiated. Okay, we're looking for a single mech out there, probably possibly already damaged. Commander, I've got a heat. S okay, that's an awesome commander. I got a heat signature in this area. Good odds, that's our target. Get eyes on it and confirm. Good hunting, Commander. When you're ready to evac, Commander, I'll pick you up here. Six Reserve Cavalry, all forward. Drive these fools from the battlefield in dishonor. Oh, excuse me. Heading that way. On the way, nice and slow. Affirmative. I'm glad I brought the land air max. Acknowledged. On my way. Hey, diddle diddle. On the move. Awaiting orders. Heading that way. Roger that.
I have a bad feeling. Heading out. Hey, diddle diddle. And yeah, it's an awesome 8R. Huh, XO? Were we expecting company? Because I'm tracking a leopard on radar and it's moving real fast. Sounds like more trouble, Meyer. Give the commander a, the location of the likely LZ. I don't know who it is, but I'm betting they're not friendlies. Commander? I'm reserving down to one. There should be more than just that awesome. Bunny here. Sprinting. Yeah. Roger that. Waiting for orders. Just we so we have a idea of what we're going to be dealing with. as fast as I can. Except for Harmony. Harmony could stay there. Duncan Fisher here. Heading that way. What do you need, Commander? Send for those for long and brace. Alright. Pirate markings? Oh, it was only the one mech. Let's see what the pirates brought. Black Knight? Okay. Okay. okay I'm... Okay, those three could go. I want the catapult. Standing by. Confirmed. Taking a risk here. Let's just get rid of this one. Roger that. Okay, I understand. I failed to connect. Heat critical. Shutting Shit. down. Shit. And I melt down one of the heat sinks on it. That's not good. Bunny here. Hey, diddle diddle. Okay, let's take a head, crack a, a head shot on this. Time to give up the thunder buttons. Nope, no head shot.
plus. Okay. Commander. Don't you sass me. Yep. Turn off those LRMs for now. Lock in time. Well, I don't think we're gonna get I that, Mac. You didn't like that, did ya? Standing by. And one bucket buster. And miss. I'm out of long range missiles. No, you're out of a bunker buster. Catapult. Let's target the Warhammer. Firing at it. I think I hit something good. Yep, you I did. LRN. Two critical hits to the engine. Nice. Duncan Fisher here. Heading that way. Let's try for a headshot. Lighting him up. I don't want the mech anymore. Something just went boom. What's that smell? Like bourbon and steak. Uh, how many times should I tell you this? Tell you this, Duncan. You don't pack the bourbon and your steaks in your mech. Live to serve. I am the wind. Locked and loaded. Here it comes. The last primary target is down, Commander. Yeah, last primary target. I want to take out those. As I was saying, I want to take out those pirates. What do you need, Commander? Okay, I was a little bit too far away, I see. Which one are we going to be targeting? The Black Knight.
Of course, you took out the arm, which is the most underprotected thing I have. Coming apart around me. You should be I used am. to this. Okay, systems back online. Sprinting. And guns, guns, guns. As I, I'm listening. As I keep telling, keep telling you off, out of, say off the cops. The the thing is built, held together by duct tape. The arms. Oh, I hate you, I'm you. Taking heavy hits, Commander. I hate that guillotine. Ready to get it on. Position confirmed. I think I able to salvage Target that. Limited. Nope. If I somehow salvage the guillotine, I am gonna assemble it and use it out of spite. That hit something important. Again, it's the arms that are duct taped on. Not really important. It's good to go. is overheating. Duncan Fisher here. What do you need, Commander? Perfect. Time to pour on the speed. Taking the shot, Commander. Oh wait, die. Put it to max. Max amount of money, so standing by really doesn't matter. Well, it's still the principle of the thing. All right, I'm standing here. Full throttle. I'm on the clock. What do you want? I will be done. Got it, Commander. Awaiting orders. Copy that. That. Bunny here. Sprinting. No, no, no. Use the precision strike. 
and guns, guns, guns. <laughs> Sucks to be that guy. Right here. Destroyed the engine. <sighs> My heat gauge is all mission successful. If I somehow get the whole entire guillotine, I'm I'm just gonna be eh. Please don't let me get the guillotine, please. Okay, I'm taking the... that. Good. I spit upon that guillotine. <laughs> By the way, please stick around for after, or say after we're done here tonight, because we're going to be doing a raid. Okay. Okay, time to get out the roll of duct tape and the bondo. Have to put those arms back on that, on that coital. Oh yeah, and fix the heat sink that melted. Yeah, sweep out the sweep out the heat sink <laughs> that's now just slag. Put in a new one, and we're good to go. <laughs> Logged and noted. Shouldn't be. Oh, that reminds me. I should fix up that dire wolf. Ugh. Where are ya? There you are, down here. More medium lasers into the arms. And UAC 10s. Two tons of ammo for it. If I remember correctly, the an LRM ten with Okay, one ton of ammo for it. And I think the other two were heat sinks. There we go.
That took a little bit more than Bondo. That took genuine OEM parts. Oxide encrusted part encrusted materials. Okay, we're gonna take the financial report and repair also. Oh, okay. Yep. I've got the financial report. Yeah, financial financials. done, Commander. And we're going to continue waiting here. Okay. Item for drinks. Test nine. Okay. And, of course, my dad sent me something. I heard the the telltale tell, tell ping of of something. Wonder what he sent me. <sighs> he knows my weakness. Barbecue. I'm just waiting for the financial report for you, Commander. Just waiting for the next next flashpoint though for heavy metal campaign. Okay, research partnership. Please, we're bleeding money here, waiting. Ready to go over financials whenever you are. Uh, you know, I actually should put some mechs into storage. But that'll be a bit later. Throw a party in the lounge. Oh, I should get Test 9 out for the hiring hall. Oh, Behemoth. I should also take Behemoth while I can. New mech warriors available. Hey, yo. New mech warriors available. Yep. New mech warriors available. And I better sell some stuff since I just spent mo money on. Stuff. And get rid of the thug. Hey, 
And my dad said more stuff to make me go... Go, why? Okay, messenger. Uh, more barbecue! <laughs> trying to think what else I could store away. Keep the palace. Store the urban mech. Oh, please don't do this to me, game. Okay. Thing froze up first. There we go. Store the urban mech. And, yeah, I'm not gonna be really using that grasshopper, so that's gonna go. As much as I want to use it. And I haven't really used that hunchback in a while, so... So while we're at it, sell the vehicles if I can. Selling the dervish. Actually, no, I'm keeping the 4P. I'm selling the Sanctuary Worlds version. And can't, no. Sell the Antos. The Rifleman. The Thug, once I can. The sun, the sun spider, and the trebuchet. There, yeah, that'll keep me covered for a tiny bit. Okay, let's assert that. If, there we go. We got the flashpoint. Nice. How <sighs> Dad sent another message. <laughs> How much you wanna bet it's more barbecue? Yep, more barbecue, more steaks. Uh it looks good. He loves to torture me, so I... S especially towards the end of my stream, it seems. <laughs> yeah, 
Anyway... On to Mantharka. Roger that, Commander. Course plotted. Engines prime. All hands for gamble transition to thrust gravity. I've got the financial report. Come on, accept it. Come on, let's get going. Okay, while we're on our way there, I have to play the play these ads. I don't want to get interrupted at the end of the stream. So we're go so I'm pressing the play ads now button and we'll be in the clear for when we finish up our stream for tonight. So see you on the other side. And he and my dad keeps sending me food. <sighs> um, supposed to be playing an ad. Oh, disconnected from the bot chat bot. There we go, ads are playing. One second, everyone. <laughs> Went to Went out of my room, went to Dad's, told him enough that he's just now laughing like a hyena. <sighs> because I don't know if you hear these pinging sounds, chat, but Dad just sent six. Things of food. I mean, we got steak, we got. Looks like pork. Pork. Chicken. Ugh. Okay, let's begin this. We're gonna take care of this one mission, and then... Okay, it's official, Commander. We found the Dobrev. So Mary's taken a dozen, ho dozen hollow pics of it already. Mayor, Mayor, care to throw an image of our derelict on the view screen? Sure thing, sure thing, Exo. Brace yourself, Commander. It isn't pretty. An image of an unfamiliar vessel fills your view screen. It appears to have come to rest in a body of deep water. The bulk of the wreck ship is, com is completely submerged. The Dobrev superstructure is warped and bent, presumably by the cumulative effects of multiple misjumps. Well, at least this time they won't be able to run off with it. Oh, okay, sorry about that. Out. Basically, Yang found a problem. Out with it, Yang. What's going on? You know, remember that cash, that crate of parts the bounty hunter gave us, the one that I loudly proclaimed to be an obvious trap? Okay, what about it? It was a trap. One of my mech techs found a tracking device embedded right in the metal. Damn things been pinging our location to the nearest HPG relay every time we've jumped. jumped. The bounty hunter has been following us, is what I'm saying. Has been since we parted ways on Independence. And I have a sinking suspicion that I know why. And he, he and I believe he's after the Dobrev, and I, we just led him straight to it. That's pretty much the size of it. So now we got two great big ticket clocks hanging over our head. The Black Widow's one of them, and the Bounty Hunter's the other. Well, either of those two could casually murder our entire company commander if we don't pick up the pace. We're gonna have to fight both of them at once. Well, guess we better move fast then. Is the Motorbjorn online and ready to go? 
My remaining combat drones are ready to deploy, Commander Wheeler. They will provide fire support for your lands in the field. I'll go make sure that our mechwares are ready to drop. Let's get to it, people. We got a job to do, and we better do it fast. Before we do, I want to do one thing. Actually, no, that's a bad idea. I was thinking of just having, getting one mech to mount a art, art or say an arrow four at, with an arrow with a Davy Crockett ammo, run right into the middle of the of the two of the bounty hunter and the black black widow fighting, and just nuke everyone at once, including themselves. But I think that would be a bad idea. Okay, I'm just doing a quick save here for this. Yeah, yeah, I know. Come on. Get out. Not Popo. Harmony. There you are, Harmony. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Oh, please don't do this to me.
do this. Okay, I s that thing there that you just saw pop up, that was that was uh, f something for Discord. When my whenever I have fr friends decide to pop in, usually it's usually it's Yoza. There we go. Command interface initiated. Wish I knew why the bitrate's been unstable as of late. Okay, yeah, last stand. Basically. And the drones are here. Surf down to one. Let them go first. Yeah, it's just everything is just acting up tonight. It always does with Baltic Advanced. I have no idea why. It's vexing. Okay, we got a Sunder. Ooh, a Marauder 2. No, I think it's just the way my I'm set up. I have no idea how to fix it. I'm gonna have to figure it out, though.
I think I know what's going on, Yoza. I think you cursed me. <laughs> I'm kidding, by the way. I live to serve. Pop my neck. Wondering what this is, though. PPCs for now. See if I'm sober enough to line this up. We're not trying to break kneecaps, we're trying to take out the engine. What do you need, Commander? Let's move myself over here. On the way, nice and slow. Taking the shot, Commander. There we go, and soften him up nice. Soften that one up a bit. I want to see if I can try to get a headshot on this thing. Wait for my turn. Let it become my turn. Ready for orders. Second, that's an imp. Yeah, two chances to get another imp. Nice. Primitive. Heat damage. 
damn it! Damn it! And just so you know, as I said, we'll be finishing this mission, and then we're going to call it for tonight. At least tonight where I am. Let's reserve down. Get all of our... Get the rest of them on the same page. What do you need, Commander? On the way, nice and slow. Taking the shot, Commander. There goes one mech. The sun is shining, the birds are singing, and the weapons are striking true. That's good. Gonna do a sensor lock on the imp. Sensor lock on target. And another dropship coming incoming. to wait again for my turn. I got a feeling those combat drones are not going to survive. Order. Turn off those. Aim for the head. Primitive. I'm taking heat damage. What do you need, Commander? Oh, 
focus on the Shrek 8 Auto Cannon Carrier. It's all ogre now for it, though. Taking the shot, Commander. Ah, I thought I had. Thought I had a bit more there. Think, what are we gonna do here? I'm on the clock. What do you want? Let's try to go for a headshot. So we're this close. Let's see if I'm sober enough. I am happy. Happy, happy, happy! Yeah, it's getting pretty fucking warm in here. Turning off the SRMs. Headshot? Yes, another one! That means we got ourselves two assault mech. Excuse me, two assault class mechs. Okay, I tell you throwing battle mechs in your way, blah blah blah. Yeah, both of those were nice shots. <laughs> I just took a I just took a gamble there. That means I got myself a two imps. And now that we're on her too. Okay, sixty five, eighty five, eighty five, seventy five. Trying to think what's in this eighty five ton range. What do you need, Commander? I'm receiving you. I should have you I'm run up way. that way. Double time. Let's sensor lock that. Got a lock. Orion. Oh, ON2M. Three medium pulses, a gauss rifle, and an LRM-15. Interesting. But it's time for Harmony's turn. I'm going to have him target the Orion. What do you need, Commander? Taking the shot, Commander.
Now what is the drone gonna do? can only just move. Let's make some bad decisions at high speed. Myself, though. I could sprint. Okay, Thunderbolt, Longbow. Wait, what type of engine? Standard, so yeah. That Shrek carrier is just having all, having all sorts of fun. <laughs> just losing machine guns at, and upon machine guns. I'm surprised that hasn't. You annoy me. Warning. Armor low. Armor low where? No, 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 no. Really, there's nothing. Order. Armor low. Confirmed. Not the Thunderbolt, the Orion. Oh. I'll take the overload. There we go, one down. Enemy destroyed. Over the red line. By the way, I have next week planned out for Battletech Advance. Next week, we're going to finish off the Heavy Metal campaign, fight a dropship, and then, if we have time after that, do the BTA challenge to wrap up the whole career. If not, it'll just be taking on, it'll be taking on the taking on just those two things. What do you need, Commander? Taking the shot, Commander.
that's one more bad guy off the board. Oh, we can salvage that completely. Interesting. I know one's the longbow, but I can't remember what the other one is. And it's backing up. Probably another longbow. They're both longbows. Just those two longbows left, and we'll be good to go. To inform you on paper kill. Okay, what's the other one? Oh, just pure LRMs. At least this one has medium lasers. What do you need, Commander? Swap the two long. Concentrate the fire in the, tor uh, the torso. Center torso, to be precise. That target's having a real bad day. that one. Hostile removed. And just one more mech to go. Watch my heat. I'm taking damage. Center torso's open, and I'm coming in for the kill. Enjoy! Enemy mech. What? 
Escort surviving combat drones to evac. What the? F yeah, blah blah blah. Mission successful. I don't know why that popped up, but okay. Okay, let's see what we got for salvage before we pack it up for tonight. Where are you? And I'm taking that one, taking a longbow part. That one to be precise. And. There we go. I'll take... Just so you know, I am not going to be taking the payout. I am going to be taking the challenge. Of course, as I mentioned. We're going to be fighting the... Fighting the Black Widow and the Bounty Hunter at the same time, but... Not, not, on, not on this stream. We're 15 minutes over, going on to 16. Come on. Come on, game. Load up faster. Standoff 2. Okay, Commander, I plugged Motor Bjorn into the Dobriv and is working to access the derelict's navigation logs. The ship is strange, very spartan, very cold. I've never seen anything quite like it. It's just a ship, Doc. Try not to read too much into it. As far as the salvage job is concerned, we're making progress, but it's slow. Most of the ship has already been picked clean by the Bowman Group. We're analyzing the Dobriv's schematics for anything they may have missed. Hidden cargo bay is that sort of thing. But it's going to take time. Keep looking, Motorbjorn. What's the status of the Dobriv's nav computer? Damaged but operable, star charts and navigation logs have suffered mild to moderate data loss. In layperson's lay terms, the files are scrambled but not irreparably so. Restoring them will take time, however. How much time are we talking about? Unknown, the Dobro's file system is reminiscent of technology that was used to build me, but there are differences that I am at a loss to explain. These unexpected discrepancies are complicating the file recovery process. All this uncertainty is making me nervous. The Black Widow and the Bounty Hunter are coming, Commander. We don't have time to screw around. Speaking of which, we're being hailed. It's Bowman. I'm surprised he hasn't crawled off with his tail between his legs. Put him on the view screen. Congratulations, Commander. You've won. Behold the fruits of your labor. Of the flooded wreck of a doomed ship. The carcass of a marvel. Cut to the chase, Bowman. What do you want? What do you think? I want to want you to collect your team and leave. I won't force, force you. I've grown weary of feeding individuals into the meat grinder that you call a company. But perhaps the carrot will succeed where the stick has failed. I'll pay you two million seabills for what's left of the Dobrev. That's my offer. Take it or leave it. Give me a minute to discuss it with my crew. I muted our mics. He can't hear us. I don't know about the rest of you, but cutting and running so is sounding really good to me right now. The Bounty Hunter and, and the Black Widow are on the way here in person to take that ship. If Nocturne Bowman wants, us to pay, wants to pay us to walk away from that, I say we let him. No, Severi, no way. We can't do this, Commander. We're on the cusp of solving, solving one of the greatest mysteries in the history of the human race. If Motor Bjorn is allowed to finish this, its task, if it recovers those navigation charts, we could find what happened, 
what became of the Starlink. That's more important than money. I don't want to leave yet either. I didn't drag my entire salvage crew onto the suck at death trap to walk away with nothing. Besides, do you really want to stab Mama Bear in the back? <clears throat> One second, I need a sip of drink. It's a machine, Yang. It isn't like its feel like its feelings will get hurt. Look, the motor bureau story is sympathetic, I get that. But the this quest is odd. Finding the star Starlink in super deep space, maybe hundreds of KF jumps away, is a pipe dream. Dream deep down you all know there's nothing out there. Your mama bear is chasing ghosts. Your answer, please, your minute is up, and I have business elsewhere to attend to. Keep your money, the dope rev is ours. Then you are a great fool, but that's your prerogative, I suppose. When you fail to extract anything of value from your shipwreck, remember the offer you turned away. Goodbye, Commander Wheeler. And that's that. That's that, then. We're about to get our shit kicked in by two of the biggest badasses in the known universe, and we gave out two million sea bills for the opportunity. Excuse me while I find a corner to weep quietly in. I need your head in the game, Meyer. Get frosty, now. We don't have much time before our enemies arrive, and we better get ready to be ready when they do. And two hours later. <coughs> it's time, Commander. I got a visual on the Black Widow's dropship, and the Argo sensors just picked up an uh, emergency signal that's probably coming that came from the bounty hunter. Anyone want to take bets which of them will kill us all first? <laughs> Neither. Neither. We're going to fight them. We're good and we're gonna win. This company built itself up from nothing. We fought every inch of progress we've made, and when the day is done, we'll be the frontier mercenaries who fought against not one but two living legends at one. Honest to God giant killers, and it'll happen because that's that's what we are. Damn right we are, Darius. Hail the Black Widow's drops or tell her I demand a parlay. Whatever good fortune you've been coasting on just ran out, Wheeler. When your cockpit collapses in around you, remember I gave you a way out of this. Remember that you refused it. Okay, you want a piece of me? The fe feeling's mutual. So you consider this a formal challenge. We fight. Lance to lance, winner takes the derelict. You're star stalling. Try bu trying to buy time. For what, I wonder? The Dobrev will not never fly again. That much is obvious. Perhaps you're looting her for trinket trinkets. But it doesn't matter. None of your people are going to make it off this rock alive. We'll make you eat those words, Kerensky. Our lads will meet you on the battlefield. And I'll bury them there. <laughs> you know, boss, even when you manage to disable the Black Widow's mech somehow, she'll just eject and get into another one. It's only a matter of time before she makes it to the Dobrev. I don't know about you, Doc, but I don't want to be around when she gets here. We're on the same page, believe me. The moment mo the Motor Bureau's finished collecting its navigational logs, We'll be ready to run. After we're safely aboard the Argo, and the Black Widow the Black Widow can do whatever she wants with the Dobrev. We won't need it. And we don't need to protect the de derelict indefinitely. I get that, but there's one thing I haven't gotten a straight answer on yet. How the hell are we supposed to win a fight against the Black Widow, and how the, the double how are we supposed to beat her and the Bounty Hunter at the same time? We won't need to beat them. We, all we need to do is live long enough for them to beat each other. We finish off the loser. Because they hate each other, right? The blood feud said she told us back. Uh, uh, she told us about back at Appian. This could work. I'm still scared shitless, mind you, but yeah, it could work. Is where the shop. I'll have shot. I'll have my team back on the Argo. Hump. Oh, uh, on the uh, have my team back on the Argo hump the bounty hunter's crate into the leopard's cargo bay. In theory, it'll lure him right to us. Commander Wheeler gave us a plan, people. It's our job to carry it out. Now get your war faces on. The enemy is at our doorstep, and we're going to show them how it's done. And that's where we're going to leave it off for tonight. I thank you all for tuning in. Oh, hello. Thought I... Come on. Come on, OBS. Work. Uh... OBS?
Now it's the game that's causing issues again. There we go. All tapped. Finally. Uh, come on, game. Uh, computer. Fuck you, computer. You want to do this to me right now? I'm not happy. Oh, there we go. As I was saying... Oh, I see what happened. It disconnected from the, the Steam bo streamer bot again. There we go. Again, I thank you all for tuning in. For those who are new here and a bit have been sticking around to the end, well, if you want to want to, please hit that heart icon down below to become a follower. If you're really interested in supporting me, please subscribe if you want to. But anyway, my this is my schedule. As you see, it's Backware Online on Fridays, any game on Sundays, and Battletech Advance 362 on Mondays. All streams start at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I have a Twitter account, as you can see in chat. Um, when I post whenever I go live, or whenever I find, inter find anything interesting that I want to post there. Of course, link is in the chat, as I mentioned. And I also have a Discord channel. There's a Discord server. Yes, that's right. I, if you want to hang out with me in my Discord server, just click on the link in chat. It'll take you right to it. And it'll, and if you, it'll also tell you whenever I go live. Anyway, I thank you all for tuning in. Now, we're going to set up to raid the um, Ghost Wizards. He's also playing Battletech Advance 362. Give me one second. Okay, and we're about to raid now. Anyway, I thank you all for tuning in. Please, stay safe out there, everyone. Bye!